Hello everyone, this is Professor Patterns. Now OpenWebUI version 0.5.3 is currently out and the biggest change that they have introduced is the channels section. So first, let me show you what it looks like. Now in my admin panel, I have two users. One is me and one is John Doe. This is a test account. This is what John Doe sees. Now here on my user profile, I can create a new channel if I wanted to. I can have it public or private. If I create a private one, John Doe wouldn't be able to see that. Now on my main channel, for example, if I type in a message like, hi, you'll see that John Doe is also able to see that message. Now John Doe can simply say, hey, and you can see that this is sort of like this Discord style interface. Now here, for example, I can react to this message. And if I wanted to, I could even continue or reply in this thread. How's it going? And this is what it looks like within the interface. Now this is just the beginning. It's a way in which you can really interact with all of the different users who are using your um, Open Web UI account. Now, right now, the developers or the creators of Open Web UI are also working on this bot. So the bot would essentially allow us to also interact with a large language model within the channels interface. So I did some playing around with it, and this is what I was able to come up with so far. So if I type in a message like what's the capital of France, and then if I end any message with AI, it should respond with a message from the large language model. So the capital of France is Paris. If I just type in what's the capital of France by itself, it shouldn't really say anything. So any message right now that I end with AI, it responds or it gives me a message back from any large language model. So this is not currently in production. The code base is here. All I did was I cloned the repository and I tried to test it out myself. However, right now, the basic functionality that you would have is that you'd essentially be able to chat with all of the different user accounts in your profile. A quick note is that in order to enable channels, you will have to restart your Docker container. And the new Docker run command also has the environment variable for enable channels equals to true. So I'm going to copy and paste this entire um, Docker run command in the description. So definitely take a look at that as well. And of course, if my pull request does get approved, then everyone should be able to have access to this functionality really quickly. Um, the only thing over here is that I just said any message that ends with AI, but if you want to, we could say any message that ends with bot or maybe like bot or whatever. We can change that, but um, this should be coming into the platform really quickly. Thank you all for tuning in. I really appreciate you for your time and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.